Uh, we're taking you back to the ring. Burt Barron. Okay, is our ring fixed? I guess so. Well, I think we got our ring fixed. That's more like it. All right, who's having a great time tonight? Man, oh man. You guys are a fun group. This is a great way to spend a Friday night. I'm really having a great time myself. You ready for more D2W Pro Wrestling action? Come on, let them hear you way in the back. Are you ready for some more action? That's what I'm talking about. Here we go. The following contest is a very special D2W ladies match. Uh-oh, the ladies are going to get dirty. Introducing first from Long Island, New York. Kane has no time for the fans. Her parents better watch his back. back up. And her opponents her from him. Mount Arlington, New Jersey, Deanna. DTW Pro Wrestling. The last time we were in this building, Debbie Kane picked up a big victory over Deanna. And I know Deanna still has that in the back of her head. Debbie used a handful of tights to pick up that victory, but a victory is a victory all the same. And Debbie looks less impressed with her now than she ever has. And Scott Volk calls for the bell, we're underway. The DTW ladies, Carmen Evo tie up. Side headlock, right into a headlock here. Take o takes her over. Quick roll up attempt, Diana. She better look out, gotta keep that pace. Irish whip off the ropes, perhaps. But no, Debbie, Debbie holding on tight. Diana's holding on tight. Not much happening right here. These women know each other so well, trying to jockey for position early on. Oh, the shoulders are just about down. Pushing Deanna back up against the ropes. Oh, oh and Debbie K telling the referee she broke it and to shut up. Shoulder tackle. Backslide here into Kane. But only a two count. Debbie ain't barely able to slide her shoulder out the back door here. She takes down Deanna hard onto the mat. <laughs> Debbie is just telling off this whole birthday crew. Ryan here enjoying his 11th birthday, and Debbie just having a mouthful of bad words to yell right at him. Man, oh man. Definitely wouldn't let Debbie Kane babysit my kids, that's for darn sure. And now, working on the lower back of Perrazzo, Debbie Kane, this malicious assault, hooks the he's gonna get it right here, but no. This is quite the aggressive side we're seeing of Debbie Kane. Very soft spoken usually. Tonight she's having some words for the fans, words for Perazzo, even words for the referee. Snap suplex into beauty, hooks the leg, does she get her but now? The kid just 
just asked if Debbie's still in her Halloween costume. That kid better look out in the parking lot. Because if he says trick or treat, I have a feeling that she's got a couple tricks up her sleeves. Certainly no treats. I heard that when the kids knocked on Debbie Kane's door for Halloween, she opened the door and gave them all clotheslines. That's what I heard. It's just a rumor, you can't believe everything you read online. But I'm just saying. She has one of the most wicked clotheslines in all the women's wrestling. If she hits it tonight, it could be over as she just pulls the hair and whiplash effect snaps the neck down onto the mat hard. Perrazzo really feeling this vicious assault set forth by Kane, the Babylon, Long Island, New York native. Definitely a vicious assault. Slamming Deanna into the turnbuckles. Irish up the ropes and, and there's that clothesline from Kane. Debbie Kane for the cover. Here's gonna be it, but no. Whip into the corner. There's a roll up from Perrazzo. <laughs> Debbie Kane able to slide out the back door. And there's a shoulder tackle from Perrazzo. Another one. Kane is down once again. Irish whip reversal from Debbie. Debbie puts her head down too soon, though. And she pays for it. She just gets a knee right to the temple. Credit to Debbie, able to kick out of the hellacious arsenal set forth by Perrazzo. Debbie Kane on the second turnbuckle now. We don't normally see her up on the ropes too often. And she goes for a double axe handle smash. She's caught. She got caught. Oh, and that look at that hellacious DDT from Perrazzo. And that's it for the Feet. She hits a Peraza special. That hellacious implant DDT right in the middle of the squared circle for the one, two, three. Evening the score here in Warren against her arch nemesis, Debbie Kane. They each have one victory apiece here at the American Legion. She's off to celebrate another. Fantastic victory. Debbie Kane, not a happy camper. She's going back to Long Island with the L tonight. More action coming up next.